sports water. I mean, once again, tell the tape here, not a big difference. Man, it's amazing how almost identical, like less than a pound difference. 3.7 pounds. His bare knuckle record stands at one victory opposite a single defeat. He holds an impressive pro boxing record, 21 victories, five defeats. Fighters up to scratch, Rick, sporting ready? touch of hands. Rick, are you ready? Let's knuckle up. The bell in round number one. Black trucks for Steve Aurelius. Oh, dark gold trucks for Juan Torres into the clinch. Exactly where Torres wants to be. Lands the big left hand. You see the bullying pressure. And Aurelius has got to be careful right now not to waste too much energy. He's throwing a lot of punches right now. Break clean, break clean, break clean, break clean, break clean, break clean. Come on, gentlemen. There's Great call by Christopher Young. Right back to it. Aurelius, big swings from the outside, trying to walk down. Immediately inside comes Juan Torres. Torres, the driving Three. pressure. We'll see Three. the patience of Christopher oh, Young. No patience Actually. there. Quick separation. Look. Good right hand lands from Aurelius. Aurelius has got to pop some more jabs out there and keep his opponent at the end of his punches right there. He's, getting, he's the one getting close. Torres back, back, back into the clinch. Now. You see Aurelius trying to throw the left hand. Three. He needs to quit focus on the bare knuckle look, look. fighting aspect and focus on the boxing. Utilize that superior boxing. See the head movement. Aurelius trying to bait in Torres, sticking out his chin. Underhook now held by Aurelius trying to drive Torres Stop. back. Stop. Free Christopher Young working. Illegal, okay? Torres claiming he was punched look, in the back of the head. 45 seconds remaining round number one. Aurelius was really talking about how important the jab is, most important punch. He's not really throwing it, he's coming with power punches all the time. He's falling in love with trying to knock his opponent oh, out with one punch. Look, look. You to see action, baby. This is for Young. One of those fighters, he needs to see action. His action is just on the inside, Chris. Yeah, which is weird because Aurelius should not want to be in this position at all. He should try and stay on the outside. I like look, what he did there, though. He put his hands down, he's waiting to counter. As soon as the opponent comes in, he's throwing punches. Jump in with the right hand. You see Aurelius, hands down, chin out, trying to bait in Juan Torres. Exactly. He feels like his opponent's slower than him, and he can react quicker. Every time he comes in, he thinks he's going to land a good punch. That is the end of round number one. Listen, listen. I, I, I can't break. You can't hit him on the break, okay? Yeah. 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 okay? Show of sportsmanship, round number two. Torres overhand right for the entry. There's the driving pressure from Torres. And just bullied him in there. Water wrestling. So you don't want Aurelius to get into tying up like Free, this. That's going to wear him out. He's not to used to this. Okay, now stop wrestling. Let's knuckle up. Just heard stop wrestling ordered by referee Christopher Young to both fighters. Left hand lands from Torres on the inside. Aurelius with the right hook. If I'm, I'm Torres, I'm doing exactly hand, this. I'm pushing him around the stop, entire stop, time. Stop, Every stop, time stop. I get a chance, I'm pushing. Warning. You, keep pu you can't punch him back in the head. Listen, you can't punch him back in the head, okay? Let's knuckle up. Referee speak, that's called a hard warning, meaning next time you commit that infraction, it's a point deduction. Young telling Aurelius punches to the back break of clean. the head. Break clean, break clean. Let's knuckle up. To reset Torres again, single-mindedly coming forward. Underhook Watch held by Juan play, Torres, huh? throwing with the left hand. 65 Three. seconds Three, remaining round number two of this heavyweight bout. Knuckle up. Come on, gentlemen. Relius from the southpaw stance with the right hand, straight one, two. I mean, I like the looseness. I like the way he's having the hands down to try and bait his opponent Three. in, but he has to he has to start throwing harder punches. Knuckle he's got to look to hurt his opponent. And you see Torres coming into the pocket, almost unabated. Aurelius just not throwing. Well, I mean, Torres yeah, seems right. to be out here right now. I mean, I don't think he has any fear of the punching power of his opponent. Break. Great called again by Christopher Young. Knuckle up. Almost a smile on the face of Juan Torres. Well, this fight's going exactly the way he wants it to. He's able to push his opponent around, tie Break. up at will. No, not. Break clean, not stay, and it didn't turn into a boxing match. This didn't turn into a ball. Final seconds, round number two. To the center of the ring. Both fighters talking, both clowning. Next stop, round number three. Steve Cunningham. Great fighter. I had the pleasure to be one of many commentators calling his win versus Frank Mir in April. Two of my all-time faves with his bare knuckle fighting go. championship. Knuckle Two former world champions watching another former world champion, Steve Aurelius, in his bare knuckle fighting championship oh. debut. Oh. Big shots from Juan Torres.
Just happy to tie up. I'd like to see him on the inside. He's a little shoulder push off. Coming back with some punches. Uppercuts. Right hand from Torres. Torres starting to play, starting to break, clown. Break clean, break clean, break clean. Torres told us, Chris, look, look. I don't feel that Aurelius has punching power despite his physique. Yeah, when you look at him, you feel like he'd be the hardest hitter on the card right now. Doesn't seem to be the case right now. Break! Break clean, Jimmy, break clean. Look, look. Right hand on the entry for Juan Torres. Torres wanted an inside fight. He's making this an inside fight. 45 seconds remaining round number three. I mean, the fans are going to be restless here soon if they keep tying up. They don't want the referee in there breaking up all the time. That's what has to keep happening because there's not any action. The threshold for referees Break. on when to separate is an active clinch. Right there, Christopher look, look. Young deeming that an inactive clinch. That's the break. Well, when you're not hitting hard in there, I, I consider that an inactive clinch, too. And to realize you can see he's showing flashes right there of his understanding and fighting, how he can move, slip, dodge. But you don't get points for dodging. You get points for hitting people. There's Aurelius now clowning on those Second dodges. Seconds, Final Jimmy, seconds, seconds, round number three. Aurelius with his back against the ropes. Torres driving pressure forward with his head. Break. We move to round four. Still to come to the scores right here. And here's what we're talking about. There's some of the action. That's why the referee's letting us go. They're inside. They're actually throwing good punches in there. And that one kind of looks like it wobbled Relios. Good uppercut attempt right there. Take his head. That's what we're judges on the 10-point plus system. Scheduled for five two-minute rounds. You didn't start for both men to start round number four off the scratch line. See the head movement from Aurelius. Aurelius trying turning. to turn up the temperature. Straighter punches. Torres right back to the inside. So looking to utilize the clinch, the dirty boxing. Break right clean, break right clean. And that's what Aurelius seems to be doing the whole time. He's putting his hands out and saying, look, this guy's doing nothing with this clinch. Break us back up. Torres has got to make sure he doesn't fall to that trap and start putting his hands down too and trying I'll to clown. And straight up for Aurelius. Torres off the right hand, shakes his head no at Aurelius. They're definitely talking to each other, Chris. Come on, now, y'all fight, huh? Now, hands on hips, Torres waving Aurelius forward. Short right hand from Juan Torres. Good uppercut right there by Torres. Or, sorry, Aurelius. Definitely disquiet in this crowd here at Hard Rock Live in Hollywood, Florida. Definitely picking up the pace. Steve's doing a much better job this round. Short left hands in the clinch. There's the break again from Look Christopher up. Young. Young doing his best to keep this fight moving. Right hand from Aurelius. Like I said, he's throwing flashes right there. Good head movement. He's very elusive. He's got to make sure every time he uses that head movement, he comes break. back with punches. Break, please, Aurelius was just talking to Young, saying, Look when are you going to break us? And then Torres legally punched him in the face with the right hand. That's really the learning curve, isn't it, Chris? For successful pro boxers in BKFC. The clinch, the infighting, the dirty boxing. Well, he, and he fell victim to it early. He was he was embracing it. He was grabbing it. He's not used to it. He's like, oh, I can grab this guy and hit, but he wasn't landing clean. And you see the clowning from Aurelius. Hands down, chin out. Final seconds, round number four. We will move to the fifth and final round. Versus Juan Torres. You know, I've been watching, and they try and, like, hit, you know, give each other uh, knuckles e each, in between each round, and I don't think they've landed them once. Left to the body from the clinch for Aurelius. Overhook held on the left side by Torres, then lets it stop, go. Stop, 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 stop. This can, this can be, come on now, come on now. Pick, pick up the pace now. Again, Torres, with his 23 pro MMA bout experience, this is largely how he fights MMA. I've commentated <laughs> him in MMA, and he fights just like this. <laughs> You know, once again, he talked about having the cardio to go hard the whole time. I think he's, he's starting to hit that wall right now. You can tell. Look at his hands are down. He's throwing sloppy punches right now. The one thing he's able to do is push his opponent around. 
See, Aurelius wants distance. He wants to throw long, okay. but Torres look, look. continually closes the gap, just like that on cue. There's the right hand from Juan Torres. And that's where he has to step back, do some rock backs, throw some uppercuts. Three. 60 look, look. seconds remaining, fifth and final round. Both fighters' faces relatively clean. Very slight swelling under the right eye of Torres. Break again for Christopher Young. Look. Young is definitely working in this bout. <laughs> right hand misses the mark from Aurelius. Aurelius now waving Torres forward. Torres was definitely obliging. That's exactly what he wants to do, come forward and tie up. Aurelius did a couple of times. We just put his hand straight out after the tie up to say, nothing's happening here. Break us, referee, and I think he needs to do more of that. Right hand getting through from Steve Aurelius. 15 seconds Break. remaining in this fight. I mean, he's definitely landed a few more punches right now, but once again, does that forward like pressure mean anything? Oh, finish Naked finish right off. hand from Aurelius doesn't land finish hard. Throw his head into the chest, throwing to the body. That is the end of the fight. The crowd very unhappy. The decision. Steve Centurion and Adios! I mean, I mean, once again, right there, we see the, the judges right now. They're not really giving it to the guy who's pushing forward. It seems like they're giving it to the counterpuncher. You never know what it's going to be this time. It's going to be the guy.